Ever wonder why the world's best and most successful have professional coaches? Like how do you how does one accelerate the results in their life and close the gap from where they are to where they want to be so quickly? Is it because they're more gifted and special than you? I don't think so. My name's Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design, and today's video is the power of professional coaching and how it changed my life. Before we jump in, I just want to give a quick shout out to Jessica Sandoval. She is a new subscriber on the channel, so big shout out. Thank you, Jessica. We appreciate you. If you subscribe and I didn't give you a shout out, please let me know in the comments below so I can give you your shout out. All right, let's jump in. So the power of professional coaching. What is professional coaching? Because a lot of days, a lot of times nowadays, a lot of people think of coaching as a sports coach, right? Like how to make someone better at a specific sport or skill. And while that is true, we're talking about professional coaching around the psychology, the mindset, right? Because everything is 80% psychology, 20% strategy, as Tony Robbins himself would say. And so with that, I'm talking about professional coaches that are not playing as sports, but are talking about high performance and, uh, and performance in general. And so what is professional coaching? I'll get into that in another video, but a short, quick version is professional coaches, what they do is they help people from where they are to where they go, want to go, and how do they close that gap in the fastest time frame possible? Because there's things that get in the way that slow us down, and so the coach can kind of take that 50,000 foot view and see the bigger picture and be able to help kind of say, okay, here's what I'm seeing. Why did you choose this? What if you would have went this way? What if you do that? What are you thinking here? And when the professional coach helps you change your perspective, right? It's like you're on the first floor. You can only see so far out. But when you're on the 50th floor, you can see so much further. And so a professional coach helps point out those things, helps elevate you to a different perspective so that you can go after and get the results that you're looking for. So <clears throat> it's kind of like, how it's helped me, how professional coaching helped me. And it was many years ago, I think it was maybe like eight years ago, going on eight years ago, I remember I met my wife at a Tony Robbins event. However, we talked for only a few minutes. And I remember my friends were with me and one of the things that they did was when we went over and I started talking to my wife at the time, I didn't know she was my wife, right? She was just this gorgeous girl that I just really wanted to get to know. And uh, my friend said something silly and I looked at him and I'm like, dude, really? Why would you say something like that? And when I turned around, she was gone. She was walking away. <clears throat> And I was like, no, but thank God I got her name off of her name tag. Thank you to the power of name tags. So I met her on Facebook. I found her. I know it might seem a little weird or creepy, but when you're committed and you know your outcome, you do whatever it takes. You get resourceful and you do what you need to do. And I did. So anyway, with that being said, I went out and I found her on Facebook. We started talking a little bit. I knew, you know, personal development. She was at the event. So that was a great way to build rapport. And like, how did she find Tony and love Tony? And she worked for the company at one point. And so we just started talking. And, you know, I used that I was a coach for Tony Robbins at the time. And it was so cool because we connected on that path. And then we started texting and getting a FaceTime here and there. And I remember at that time in our in her life, she was she really wanted to be in a committed relationship. And she was kind of talking to this guy. They would hang out off and on. But he wasn't what she wanted in a man, right? It wasn't what she wanted long term. So they would just hang out, but both with the understanding that if they met someone, totally cool. And I remember when I would text her or message her, she usually would get back to me, she'd be flirty, but if she didn't, that meant she was with him. And I went home on a trip for a week in New Jersey to the shore with family. And I remember I just kind of, I got in my head, right? And I was like, she's with this guy. I live in San Diego. She lives in the Bay Area. Why would she leave her family? Why would she quit her job? Why would she stop talking to this guy? And all these stories just got in my head. And I was like, I was ready to run my old pattern in relationships where I threw people away. And, and even before we even got to know each other, spend time with each other. And I remember I reached out to my coach and I was like, hey, do you have five minutes? And we jumped on a call and we were talking. <clears throat> And I remember her asking one question that helped change everything for me. She said, Joe, what do you want? And I said, I want her. And she goes, then why don't you go get it? 
And from that point forward, it's like the switch went on. I was like, you're right. She's everything I want in a woman. We traded lists. Like, I was flying her down to San Diego to spend the weekend with me. And I was just like, why would I throw her away? Like, I want her. Let's go after her. And let all the other pieces that seem impossible to me, let, you know, God do his magic, right? Let the universe do what it needs to do to align everything. And if it's true love, then it was meant to be. And... I flew back to San Diego and a, f a couple days later she flew down and we just had the most magical time. We, you know, I got her from the plane, I had a sign, I had flowers for her. Um, then I took her to, we did a picnic on the beach to watch the sunset that evening after we ate and it was just like, it was awesome. Like we knew, we hit it off and the rest is history. But if it wasn't for my coach, I probably would have threw her out of my relationship and ran that same pattern. And as a result of that one coaching session, it changed my life forever. I literally met the woman in my dream. She's my queen. We made the decision to create the, uh, the cell phone laptop lifestyle where we can earn money anywhere in the world through our profession and make an impact. We've built a home out in the outskirts of Boise, Idaho. We have two beautiful boys that are just the most amazing kids. And it's just like, we have this amazing abundant life. And I don't say that to brag upon you. I say that because the power of coaching can literally one call, just one call. Could you imagine what six months working with someone or a year could do for you? It's like that one call had such a ripple effect to some beautiful, amazing life that we live today. And, you know, I just thank God every day for it. But it's like, man, if I didn't have that one call, what would have happened? Would I have never met her or seen her or went on this journey with her? We wouldn't be where we are today. I wouldn't have my boys. Like, thank God for this call and my coach at the time. And so that's how it's made an impact for me. And I've continued to have coaches over the years and they've all had a major impact at certain seasons for me. But as a coach, I get to see on the inside of people's worlds and really see, <clears throat> again, from that 50,000 foot view is what's going on, what's holding them back. And it's amazing. And every category of life, I've been able to help coach our clients transform. I had one client, he had a business running Facebook ads at the time. He was stuck around that $55,000 a month mark. And there were some things that were holding him back, system processes, his own internal stuff. And we transformed it. And within months later, his business went from around that $55,000 a month income to $165,000. So an increase of a hundred grand over in a month. I mean, come on, let's be honest. Would an extra hundred grand, even if you had to pay taxes and people and all that good stuff afterwards, would that still help you? What was left over? I think it would for a lot of us, right? I remember helping him. I had a client of mine. He was, a, um, he was working a nine to five job. It wasn't his highest calling. <clears throat> How many of you have ever been in your, maybe you do currently work in a position right now. It pays the bills, but you know you were meant to give so much more. You know that there was something on your heart you wanted to do. And so he came and he was like, hey, I, I build websites, I do SEO. He's like, <clears throat> online com e commerce. He's like, I want to do that full time. And I think I could probably do it in maybe five to seven years. And as I got to know him and kind of see what was going on, uh, I told him it could be a lot sooner if he really wanted it, right? We don't have to quit our job cold turkey, but he started doing certain things and we started helping game planning and removing some of those road barriers. And within 15 months of us working together, he literally did his last day at his corporate job. And he sent me a video of his last day where he's like, I, I, I feel free. I'm leaving kind of this jail cell of a job. And not to say jobs are jail cells, but for him, that's what it felt like. And he got to go full time. He got to spend more time with his family. And most importantly, he actually sold one of his, his e-commerce websites for a hundred thousand dollars that year. And he was building others and he had clients and like, so we helped him transform. He thought it would take almost five to seven years. We did it in 15 months. He was making more money, had more freedom, and he got to spend more quality time with his family. I mean, what is that worth? And I'm not saying everyone's gonna make a hundred grand, but that was the example. There was another client I really am proud of. They were 50 pounds overweight. 
and we started seeing some patterns with them and within their psychology and we started breaking those things down and shifting beliefs and different strategies and habits and all of a sudden <clears throat> they released the 50 pounds they looked amazing they felt amazing what was most important is they had more energy and time for family to be able to do the things that they wanted to do not oh well hold on let me let me sit back and rest, right? Let me relax. Like they had the energy to make those magical memories with their family and the kids. I mean, how much is that worth to you? When your kids wanna go do something, but you're like, I can't because I'm out of shape. And so that client through the power of professional coaching got their life back. And I don't know how many years they added onto their life, which they probably would have lost. And the medications that they released, and I didn't tell them to release the medication. Their doctor said they no longer needed them because of the transformation. But it was just so amazing to see that. And then lastly, one of my clients, um, well, there's many clients that comes at times, but this one particular client, they felt really depressed. They were just in this state of depression. They felt like there was no way out. They didn't know their purpose. They felt lost in life. Have you ever felt that way? Or maybe you know someone like that. And so we started digging in and we started to identify what was going on. What were some of the triggers? What were some of the habits that they were doing to create this, this state of life, the season of life? And as we started to make that shift, they stopped being so depressed and they started becoming more happy. They started seeing the joy and the blessings and the appreciation in life, how magical this world is. They started loving the little things and not just focus on these big things and where they weren't. <clears throat> and they not only were they happy, but we started to define what is their mission in their life? Why are they here? What did God call them to be, do, or to create in this life? And we started getting clear, at least at this stage of their life. And, you know, maybe it changed for them over the years, but we helped them break free. We gave them a mission, a, 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 something to look forward, a future to look forward to. And they woke up every day happy. They woke up every day f feeling on a per like they were living their purpose. And so there's no monetary gain from that. But the internal gain from that is priceless. And so, and not even to mention on their health, right? No longer being depressed, but waking up happy and great, grateful and appreciative. It's like the power of professional coaching transformed all of that. <clears throat> See, coaching's not, professional coaching isn't for the weak, the broken, the soft hearted. In fact, it's the complete opposite. The ones that truly come to coaching, they're the ones that have the courage, the strength to be able to say, here's where I'm at, but here's where I wanna go. They're the ones that are full of power. It says, I need to make this change. I don't know what's stopping me, but I need someone to see it, po point it out. Allow me to see what I need to do differently because when I see it differently, I can be able to go ahead and make that adjustment, right? And so all of a sudden, the ones that come to coaching, they're the ones I see as whole, strong, resourceful, powerful. That's the lens that I look at my clients through. So if they try to play small, if they try to play in a victim, I call them out on that because that's not who they are, it's what they're doing. And most people, they think that that's who they are and they want. And if they think that's who they are, they have this identity. And our identity is so, we wanna remain consistent with how we see ourselves and so they're just gonna keep doing that. It's until someone calls you out on that BS, that pattern says, no way, stop playing small, play bigger. You are a bright light for this world. And so I don't allow my clients to play small. And I don't also look at them at the lens of they're broken, they're perfectly whole. And so I look at it as they're coming for a reason, for something greater, to be this bright light for the world, their family, whoever it is. And it starts with the change in them first. And it might start with the change in you. Maybe you're one of those people who are like, Joe, I have, I am powerful. I am confident. I do feel like I have a mission. I don't know what it is. Or maybe you do know what it is, but you just can't seem to get it out there. Maybe the power of professional coaching can help you too. Just like it changed my life. It changed me in having this amazing, you know, incredible queen and amazing boys. But it also helped me break financial barriers that were holding me back. I can't tell you how many times when with my coach, I've broken through the limitations of income. And so, and even in my health, I had a you know, great mentor of mine, coach, I look at him as he challenged me for my body and he always broke my, you know, my limiting beliefs and excuses. So not only did my wealth go up, not only did my health increase when I did my fitness photo shoots, right, and getting in the best shape of my life, but it also the quality of my life, the richness with my queen and my boys and our lifestyle. 
So I don't say this to brag about where I'm at. Look, there's people in far better positions than me. <clears throat> and I have my own shit show challenges at life, at life too. I have a lot coming at me in life right now. And I'm sure you do too. But when you have a coach, someone in your corner that's literally locking arms with you and saying, you're not going at this alone. I'm not going to allow you to go at this alone. I'm going to not allow you to play small at life. We're going to go together. If you want to go far, or if you want to go fast, you go alone. If you want to go far, you go with someone. And so if you're one of those people like, I just want, I just need this, something's holding me back. I don't know what it is. I feel it. I just, I don't understand. I can't see it. The power of professional coaching can open that realm up for you so that you can accelerate your results. The most successful people have a coach, not because they're not good enough. We all have our own blind spots. But in reality, what they're really after is folding time. Because you could spend a lifetime trying to figure out what was going on. You're like, oh, oh my gosh, I got it now. But you're 70. And you're like, shit, I've wasted 70 years of my life when a coach could have pointed that out in a 30-minute coaching call. Don't allow money to stop you from folding time. I always say this, money comes and goes, time never does. And the power of coaching, professional coaching, allows you to close down the time frame in which you would probably do it on your own, if ever at all, right? And so we tend to run these same patterns. Don't allow that to happen. Get a professional coach. I don't care who it is. But I would encourage you to fill out the coaching application in our description below. Allow us to come in and help support you. See if this is a fit, how we can support you. Our amazing coaches here at Master Life by Design can really help you craft the life you want or remove the things or show you the things that are holding you back so you can make those changes. And if you really want to work with me and my wife, we could talk about doing an exclusive VIP coaching partnership around that. Um, but for you, you may want to just look at you know, what if I had someone in my corner locking arms with me? How much faster could I go? What could I create in this world? How much more happier would I be? What would it feel like to really be snuggling every night with the love of your life? Or what would it feel like to never have financial struggles again? Or what if it, how much energy would you have if you released that 80 pounds? Or if you weren't in that state of depression anymore? Or if you didn't work that nine to five, what would life be like for you? These are just some small testimonials of that hundreds of clients that I've coached over the years, thousands of clients, but everyone gets their breakthrough. The question is, are you? It's changed my life and it's going to continue to change my life because I'm always looking to go to that next level and a coach is always going to help me. But what about you? Are you going to make, are you going to have the courage to step up and say, I deserve this. I am worthy of having someone in my corner with me. Cause you see successful people, they make decisions based on their goals and where they're going, not where they are. And I can't tell you how many people, it was their last penny, they borrowed money for coaching. And it was the greatest investment of their life. And their whole life changed. And economically too. And so I'm encouraging you, if that's you, fill out that coaching application. But I know this, that you were, you know, you have a better chance of winning the lottery something like three or four times than you do of being born. And if you're watching this, this means you're born. And so you hit the lottery already. So you're someone, a light, this bright light for the world, and you might not think it, but you are. And what, how you show up every day plays a ripple effect for others. You wanna change the world, start changing you first. You gotta work on you before you can go out and make an impact on the world. At least to the degree in which you're capable or which God blessed you to be. And so let's pull out that greatness from within you. Let's pull out all the magic, all the joy, all the greatness that you have inside and allow that to be a bright light for the world. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. The power of coaching transformed my life. I hope it does yours. And if you're really interested, fill out that coaching application. I'd love to hear if you've ever had a coach. Comment below. How did it transform your life? Maybe the coach you worked with, it just wasn't in alignment with you and it didn't have the impact that you wanted. Maybe another another coach would work for you. It would be a better fit because just because you date someone, if it doesn't work out, doesn't mean all you know men or women are bad. It's just it wasn't a fit. Try someone else. Date someone else and maybe they're the, you know, your partner for life. But most importantly, subscribe to this video. Hit that subscribe button and then right next to it is that little bell. Ding! hit that notification so you can get the notifications when we put these videos out when we come out with three videos a week and so i'm looking forward to adding more value to you guys i just want to get to know you all of you so comment below subscribe let me know when you do so i can give you a shout out so with that have a great day my name is joe moffitt with master life by design see you guys